I'd gone to St. Moritz in Switzerland to go down the Bob Run with the RAF team. I actually managed to go with them on the trip to St. Moritz. I thought, looking at it, I'm glad I'm not doing this, but, uh, you know, John was, uh, was up for it, and a really nice RAF team who were taking him on board. My driver was John Blocky. John was giving me the ride of a lifetime. We shot round every corner perfectly and got our speed up to around 90 miles an hour. I was standing next to, I think it was John Blocky's wife. And you could hear on the loudspeaker system what was happening on each run. But we didn't know that ahead of us there was a hole in the ice wall and by a million to one chance, we hit it. And then suddenly she said, oh, my goodness, they've had a crash. I was trapped upside down in the bob and swept along for 100 metres. On the final bend, the bob righted itself and shot through the finishing post with John Blocky still in it. I too went through the finishing post, but I was too dazed to notice. I couldn't get out of the, no, you're stuck the in. sledge, yeah. yeah. I was hemmed up against the ice. He was extremely lucky to survive. You could see the way the guys put their arms around him and walked him off the run at the end. They knew. I thought, oh, God, this could be major. But, uh, no, he was lucky. I mean, you know, he just got really badly bruised. <laughs> 